Hello everyone. Um, today we're going to be looking at Colossians chapter 2 verses 6 to 23. And one of the ideas in this passage is that everyone who accepts Jesus, everyone who chooses Jesus, is changed and will continue to change. And to help us to understand that, um, I'm going to tell you a story. And it goes like this. At the end of the street, there was a house. Everyone knew this house. The Edwards lived in this house. They'd lived there for years. But the Edwards house was a mess. It leaned to one side. But the Edwards had never bothered to have the foundations checked. The paint was peeling off the walls, but the Edwards never seemed to get around to painting it. The garden was overgrown and weeds were everywhere, but the Edwards didn't seem to mind. A window that had been broken years ago was still not fixed. The Edwards had forgotten to repair it. The front doorbell was hanging off, but the Edwards didn't see that as a problem. But then one day, something amazing happened. Overnight, the house changed. The house didn't lean anymore. For the first time in anyone's memory, the house sat straight in its foundations. The neighbours were stunned. They all wondered what had caused this sudden change in the Edwards. But the changes didn't stop there. Over the next few weeks and months, more and more things changed. The house was painted and looked brand new. The weeds were pulled out, the lawns mowed and hedges trimmed, the garden looked amazing. The broken window was replaced with a brand new window and all the windows were cleaned until they shone like new. The front doorbell was repaired. Then one day, work began on making the house bigger. More rooms were added and a second story went up. All the neighbours gathered outside the Edwards house. They wondered what had happened to cause all these changes. No one really knew. So one of the neighbours went up and rang the doorbell to ask the Edwards. The door slowly opened, but it wasn't the Edwards who answered. The Edwards had moved out. A new family had moved in. A family who truly loved the little house at the end of the street. Everyone smiled and went back to their homes. The little house at the end of the street was no longer the messy little house at the end of the street. It had changed. And they wondered what other changes this new family would lovingly make to this little house. So the little house changed. The foundation was fixed and the little house stood straight. In Colossians chapter 2, Paul says that anyone who accepts Jesus and his love is changed forever. We are now forgiven children of God. We are alive with God. But the changes don't stop there. Jesus continues to change us. We continue to change and grow as we become more and more like Jesus. Everyone who accepts Jesus and his love into their life will be changed. And everyone who accepts Jesus and his love will continue to change. Kids, adults, everyone keeps changing. Um, we've got some questions now that you can do with your families and um, hope you like that story and we'll see you next time. Bye everyone.